Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. So everybody, I'm, I've been picking up on a lot of spiritual messages today. Um, anyway, just take what resonates, leave the rest behind, and thank you so much everyone for all of your support. Oh boy, there is a karmic that is about to be shook, okay? This is somebody who's very toxic. Um... I feel like they tried to trick your person or they, they thought they were having some kind of success here. They thought they were, this karmic thought she was having some kind of victory. It's a woman, okay? Um, but that is really short-lived. This masculine is about to leave her behind. Woo, they're leaving. She's about to feel like an absolute fool. She was really like celebrating something here, okay? She was celebrating something. She thought she had some she thought she had something pinned down. Okay? Um I don't know. I feel like she tried to maybe trap this masculine or she thought she just won, you know, something like that. It feels like she she's having some kind of victory, but it's only temporary. This is something that's temporary. It's getting erased. It's getting pulled right from her. Like the the universe is yanking this victory away from her. And um, the masculine is leaving her behind. This is divine masculine energy. This is the emperor here on the bottom of the deck. Uh, yeah, there's going to be a lot of gossip about this as well. I don't know who is talking about who here. Okay, they could both be talking about each other, airing their dirty laundry all over the internet. I'm not seeing the masculine doing that, though. I feel like other people are talking about this karmic. Um, she was just, like, bragging about it, too. I feel like this karmic was bragging about um, this masculine not going to you, or maybe she was bragging that this masculine was going to be stuck with her now. I don't know. She was celebrating this. And then, boom, I feel like she's getting a major tower or something here. Um, it's a huge shakeup for this karmic. Anyway, just take what resonates. Leave the rest behind, right? And thank you so much, everyone, for all of your support. I don't know if I said all of this yet, but thank you. Yeah, somebody's, somebody is taking a, uh, a new path, and it hurts. It hurts this karmic. Oh my gosh, she's feeling and looking like a complete fool. This is like, she feels humiliated. Absolutely humiliated. And I feel like um, this somebody here is defending themselves. This is like a defensive, protective kind of card. I feel like it's this masculine. Everybody is shocked by this. This is something that this masculine could have been planning um, nobody knew that they were going to do this. This is uh, completely unexpected, okay? No one expected this. Like, people are shocked, or this karmic is shocked. It, man, I'm telling you, this karmic's gonna, gonna hurt over this. I feel like this masculine is coming towards you. Jeez, these cards are just sort of flying everywhere, you guys. So something big is like just popping off in the background here. Hold on. Yeah. Writing a new story. Yep, getting out of a karmic situation, out of a karmic loop, and starting something new. That's what this masculine is doing, and people are shook over this. They're like, what? Yeah, this was something that this masculine kept secret. Okay, they kept it secret until just the right moment to leave this karmic. And she is, she, it's like she doesn't even know what happened. She's like, what the heck? Because she was just like bragging about having a victory over you, the greatest of all time. This is what this masculine has been hiding. Is a plan to leave this karmic behind and come to you. This is divine feminine energy. So I feel like um, this is a big breakup. 
okay it's very quick it's very quick yeah see I feel like this masculine this could have happened before in the past too or it was really close during the summertime okay um, and this karmic tried to fix it well she thought she had it fixed but it was only temporary this is this is something that's temporary and her victory is the smile on her face is being wiped off right um, erased and this is something temporary a temporary fix but it's not meant to last okay so yeah and this is I feel like this was her abusing her power um, she could have been very abusive like mentally and emotionally abusive verbally abusive to this masculine okay but this was her bragging bragging about this bragging about a victory bragging about ha 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 the feminine no longer wants the masculine that kind of thing i feel like she she just wanted to hang on to this masculine um uh, you know for as long as it took for you to say forget it okay and walk away yeah she thought this was going to be permanent yep but uh that victory has just been snatched from her leaving her like absolutely dumbfounded yeah because it's this is a cycle that's closing out this masculine is closing out the cycle. It's over. It is over. And she's like, she's taking a huge hit here. Uh, like, for real. Um, yeah, cut off. This, this karmic is going to be cut off of any financial support as well. The masculine is also cut her off of communication between them. So, yeah, it's just done. They're gone. This, this masculine could have been packing boxes, something like that. This could also be, like, say this karmic was celebrating. She decided to take a vacation. Hooray! Maybe she was gone for a couple of days or something like that, um, out celebrating her big victory here in this connection. And uh, she comes back, and the masculine's already moved out everything yeah and that was a that's a confirmation Ooh, twice <laughs> twice this masculine could have already been packing boxes and moving things out of the house while she's been gone and she comes home to find like nothing there them gone um and i don't feel like it's a ghosting thing i do feel like this masculine is like kind of saying I've had enough it's over goodbye you know I'm cutting you off of any kind of financial support I'm gonna be moving out goodbye like uh, yeah it's that fast and she is like what yeah so she's I feel like she goes from laughing and smiling about this tee hee hee and about it to um, the, the, crying angry furious i feel like she's furious she's really confused as to how this happened like what happened um she may be angry with you as well yeah this masculine has completely turned their back on this karmic no more communication no more financial help and support no more connection no more relationship done they, they don't even want to talk about it. They've completely turned their back on that karmic. And now this karmic is facing her karma for meddling and getting in between a divine connection. Okay? I feel like this is a divine masculine. They're coming out as a divine masculine. You're coming out as a divine feminine. Yeah, divine feminine. There it is. So now that this masculine is out of that situation... This karma, I'm, I, this karma that's coming for the karmic, it's going to hit their life like a wrecking ball. That's pretty much what's happening now, all in like one day. All in one day. They were smiling about this, thinking they had this victory, thinking they had won, thinking that they had broken up a divine connection. They were celebrating that, and then the next day, boom, 
everything comes down. Everything crumbles. Because this, div this divine masculine is walking away. Turning their back and walking away. Yeah, look at this karma. Karmic storm. And the karmic storm hits. I cannot make it up. <laughs> I cannot make that up. And I feel like, where is this divine masculine headed? Straight back to their divine feminine. Now this masculine wants to be loyal to you. They want to be dedicated. Okay? You may, you may be thinking that they've, they really dogged you out. You know? That they were a dog. That they were a cheater. A player. A liar. Um, a betrayer. Okay? So you may not trust this person anymore. But they're coming back around uh, pretty much to ask you for your forgiveness and tell you that they're ready to get serious now. Um, yeah, this karmic, this is, this is a fake individual. Um, this is somebody who cares too much about everybody else's opinions. This is someone who, you know, competes with the Joneses, right? She, she wants to outdo other people. She wants people to believe that her life is perfect. Okay? But in all actuality now, it's just been flushed down a toilet. Because uh, she's, she's lost. She's lost. She's lost a lot. She's lost a home. She's lost a relationship with this masculine. She's lost any kind of comp competition that she could have been having with herself in this connection of yours, right? I feel like she was competing with a divine being here, you know, thinking she had won. No, oops. You know what they're showing me? Oh, my gosh. You know what they're showing me? It's a scene from, oh, what is the movie called? A Zoolander. Zoolander, they have a walk-off. Yeah, they have a walk-off, these two male models, okay? And, or no, 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 that's right. It's not the walk-off. It's at the awards. Sorry about that. They're showing me a couple of things. Yeah, that was the competition, right? She was having a competition with you. But at the awards, what they're showing me is when... Um, Zoolander, Derek Zoolander, thinks that he's going to win the, uh, the award for the year's best top model, right? And it goes to Hansel, right? It goes to Hansel, but Zoolander still gets up and goes and tries to accept that award. And in front of everybody, feels like a whole fool. Looks like a complete fool, okay? <laughs> And that's what it is. She stepped up to have that win, right? She bragged about it, okay? She bragged about it. She laughed about it. She thought it was funny that she had broken up a divine connection. Oh, but she laughed too soon, okay? Spirit took that victory away from her and turned her into a, a huge fool, okay? That's the movie scene. They're showing me two scenes, you guys, from the movie Zoolander. Okay, but yeah, that's exactly what happened for this karmic. And look what's on the bottom of the deck here is the true soulmate connection. In the sunshine, right? Uh, a warm day, right? This is a twin flame soulmate connection. This is like the perfect connection where you're both at each other's side, mutual respect, um, both giving each other dignity and honor, okay? And uh, planning a future, working together, being loyal and dedicated to each other, standing strong. This was a divine connection. And spirit, I feel like the divine just made this karmic. She just got spanked. The, basically, that's what this is. The karmic got spanked for whatever she, she was doing here. And now she's, she's in a karmic storm under judgment, getting her karma for trying to interfere and, um, and keep a twin flame soulmate connection apart. And this masculine, they're on their way back to you, Divine Feminine, okay? They're on their way back. They want union. 
they want union yeah it's judgment day this karmic um she's scared she feels this feeling of dread okay because you two are about to be happy together this is the ten of cups in this deck <laughs> this is the ten of cups that rainbow that we always see in the ten of cups that's and this is that twin flame soulmate connection this is a destiny card this is you two getting back together, and she knows it's going to happen. That's why she's dreading this. She's dreading you two getting, um, getting back together and coming into union. Yes. And this is going to last a long time. This is also the karmic getting spanked. Okay, for real. Whoo, that was crazy. This is an awesome reading, you guys. I'm so super jazzed about this reading. And congratulations to whoever is coming into union because it looks like that's what's going to happen here. Um, and this masculine is there. They want to be loyal and dedicated and absolutely devoted to you. Oh, my gosh. Anyway, um, congratulations for whoever this is for. And uh, I hope this helps. I do hope this resonates. If you like this video as much as I do, please click that like button, right? Yay! And subscribe to the channel, you guys. Join this awesome soul tribe. And until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.